Alright, hey there folks, Hi, Maytude here for another vlog style update. Just wanted to remind you all that at March 12th, 9pm Eastern Standard Time, 6pm Pacific Standard Time, will be the first ever Mr. Coat Awards. You will be able to view it all on live stream, and I have included the link below. I've been nominated, but also a lot of other really awesome people have been nominated, and I'm going to give them a shout out right now. For starters, you got Morgan Ledger of Vaulting Fame. For those of you who don't know, Morgan does a really awesome review series where he takes a look at uh, classic, underrated, nostalgic material. Also, we've got Face Nelson of Face Nelson's Reviews, also facing the music. You may remember last year we did a team up of From Pages to Pictures, The Chronicles of Narnia. That was our episode together. She's also got her own show looking at uh, all kinds of music stuff. She just recently did a terrific top 10 breakup songs list for Valentine's Day. That was awesome. Also from Animation Look Back, we have Animat, who is very well rehearsed in reviewing animated films, as well as looking back at the history of animation altogether. And it's a very nicely done series. You also see the guy's uh, title cards if you watch From Pages to Pictures. Uh, he recently did the Narnia title card, and he's got the title card coming up for my next episode as well, which is coming soon, I assure you. We have Sonic Guru, who does a terrific job reviewing video games from every console and pretty much every era. Well, well, I shouldn't say every era. He does mostly stuff from the past 10 years or so, but it's mostly stuff I don't see, so, you know, it's good as far as I'm concerned. Stefan of Animated Analysis has also been nominated for a number of different categories. Now, this guy puts a lot of effort into his show. He's even got uh, this cartoon character that pops up. Uh, Noop Rack, he calls them. It's, it's cartoon spelled backwards. That's really his take on the animation reviewing scene, as you might say. We also have some jerk with a camera who puts amazing effort into his work. This guy, Tony Goldmark, uh, he does a lot of amazing stuff. He reviews amusement park rides, which is, you know, nobody does that, but on top of that, He's absolutely hilarious, and he's even gotten Weird Al Yankovic to do cameos in some of his episodes. Celebrity cameos on a web series, that's pretty amazing. South Jersey Sam has also been nominated. He doesn't just do films and TV shows, but also he once did a fan fiction review, which was pretty hilarious. That guy's got a lot of good stuff. Everything he does, he appears as a Gmod character, which I find actually very clever. Huey Toonmore of Huey's Animated Movie Reviews. You may remember this gentleman. He also does animated movie reviews, but last year he and I did the top 11 next best scares of childhood, which has been nominated, so... Yeah, you can check out his stuff. He's pretty good. Topher J of Movie Misperception, a man who takes a look at films that have been forgotten or he considers them to be underrated, but he absolutely loves them all. Uh, he's fairly fresh and new on the scene, but he's still got stuff going. And last but certainly not least, Cabell Studios, who ran Animated Amnesia for uh, quite some period of time. He doesn't seem to have much coming out as of late, but he did have a terrific multi-part review of the movie The Last Airbender, which I was glad to be a part of last year. That was a lot of fun, and that's up for nomination. So if you want to check out these awesome people, I've got uh, links below to all their different YouTube channels. You can check them out, give them a subscription maybe. And if you come to the live event on March 12th, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, you may even be able to meet some of them along with myself. You never know. Also, before I forget, congratulations to Mike Dutton for his Special Achievement Award. Mike Dutton is the terrific comic artist behind such creations as Tales of Putyra. I'm going to pronounce it correctly. Tales of Putyra, which you can check out in the description box below. Also, if you saw my Stand By Me vs. The Body from Pages to Pictures episode, you saw his title card. The man is terrific when it comes to artwork. So. Congratulations, Mike. You totally deserve it. Last thing I want to mention is that I have opened up a new channel here on YouTube for 
Sullivan Entertainment, and Flyboy Films. I hope to update that more frequently with a lot of my official stuff. So, again, check the link below. You'll find a link to that YouTube account. I have already updated it with a short film of mine from 2009 entitled The Good Sitter, which is a short family film that's been sitting around for a few years now, and I just decided, you know what? It's time the world saw it. You know, it's time that somebody uploaded it to YouTube and you were able to see the full thing. And so, if you want to see some older work that I did, that's definitely something that I encourage you to check out. I think you're going to like it. So, anyway, that's all I have to say for this update, and I will keep you posted. Ciao for now, y'all. Nice pants.